before the general elections, politicians in Kano signed a peace agreement with the Nigerian police in the state. However, it appears some politicians are not keeping to the agreement. The chairman of the PDP Vanguard and former commissioner in Kano, Mr. Musa Ilyasu Kwakonso, has been accused of mobilizing youths to disrupt the electoral process, including snatching of ballot boxes at the hometown of the state governor. The man in question is said to currently be at large, but has been declared wanted by the police in Kano. Detectives from Stacey Lee's Tommy's house, but unfortunately he jumped over the, the wall, that's the back wall of his house. They pursued him into the bush, but what we got the office big uh, this abada, abandoned it and disappeared. We are still looking for him up to now. Items recovered from the sponsored youths include 10 ballot boxes stocked with ballot papers, result sheets, card readers, and some dangerous weapons. One Hussein Ibrahim made of Koramata village, who belongs to, I mean, the organization called PDP Bangat in the area, I mean, approach the IMEC officials who were dividing the, what you call the ballot papers, to be distributed to the polling units, and pretend them as if they want to see samples of these, uh, what you call it, materials. While he was being attended to, he snatched some of these ballot papers and tore them and set a place 4,015 ballot papers for the governorship and state assembly elections of that, I mean, area, I mean, registration area council. Meanwhile, the police command, in collaboration with the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, is set to head to court for legal actions in accordance with the electoral law.